We'll get started. I'll bring John Pearson's views in a moment. Another good pocket of Wednesday fans here watching the Owls today, supporting the Sheffield Wednesday side playing in all green today. A slight modification of the away shirts after playing with uh, white shorts and also white on the socks as well. It's now maybe a little bit easier to uh, tell the teams apart. That was a bit of a problem, I think, at Millwall, certainly in one of the early games, as the ball is just sent forward. It goes down the line by Sheffield Wednesday, but it's going to be turned out of play, is it? No, it's still alive, and Liam Palmer has to tidy up in the left full-back position, and he immediately works it back in towards Kieran Westwood, who will kick this one long, and he's gone up towards Newey, who goes past him. Fletcher giving chase just out on this left-hand side. They should turn away from trouble there with Dyke Steele. He's got it to the halfway line. Werner just uh, cushions it down and he's able to stretch to keep hold of it for Wednesday, having taken it from Hutchinson. Goes back inside again for uh, Julian Burner. Comes out wide now for Bannon, lofts it into the box and trying to get up there was Stephen Fletcher. Dyke Steele He'll turned it back into the middle of the park. Hutchinson rolls it back into his own half and allows Iorfa to switch it away towards the right hand side now. Not a bad show. Back inside again for Hutchinson. Hutchinson, remember he's got four bookings to his name, as is this fella, Julian Burner, who's coming forward. He plays it in towards the box. Might be a struggle, but be a uh, corner. It comes off the Middlesbrough player who doesn't quite know where he's going to head that. Goes behind off Bola. Going to be a corner taken by Bannon. An arching delivery, left-footed from the Scots. As the referee just has a word with one or two components in the middle of the uh, penalty area. Pushing and shoving from both sides as it gets sent in now by Bannon. Oh, it in into yes! It's an, it's an own goal. goal! Well, that wasn't exactly what Middlesbrough were hoping for, whether that's what Barry Bannon had in mind. But he just stuck it into the danger zone and it's just been brushed over his own goalkeeper just off the top of the head. I think it might be Clayton, not 100% sure, but it definitely came off the Middlesbrough player. He was standing on his own. There was no challenge on him. And he's just, I don't know, as he tried to head it away, put it over his own bar, but all he's done is scoop it up over Randolph into his own net. And Wednesday lead early here at the Riverside Stadium. Let's not sit back. No, we'll have to see how Middlesbrough responds. Respond, but uh, been a good start so far. Oh. It's nice, isn't it, when you, you have that good pressure early on and you make it count. Exactly, it was terrific uh, cross again from Bannon. Like I say, the next goal is always vital. That's There's a foul. A foul. Stephen Fletcher's just got took out by uh, Shotton. So I would guess that Bannon's going to deliver this, but. Harris has yep. run away, and it is Bannon who puts it into the it's danger zone. No! And this time it's Iorfa putting it away with a bullet header. Well, that is some start from Sheffield Wednesday. Dominic Iorfa rising highest and putting it past Randolph. No chance once again. What a start, Sheffield Wednesday. They lead Borough by two goals to nil. What a fantastic ball is. And he was just, uh, he was asking to be headed in. He asked Iorfa, put me in the net, Dominic. And he did. He didn't disappoint. As the ball goes forward, it should be Wednesday as well, to be fair. They've done well to keep it, well, momentarily yeah. they kept it, and then Bannon just took it off the toes there of uh, Johnson. Out wide it goes now. Wednesday on the right-hand side with Adam Reach. Reach will come in Woods and lays it off there towards uh, Barry Bannon. He works it on now for Liam Palmer. Palmer now for Harris. Harris looking to try and take on Dyke Steele. He's done it again. He's got him, he's done him all ends up. He goes into Fletcher. Oh. Got it really well. Needed a save there from it's Randolph. And it's gone out. He sort of spilt it, didn't he, there, Randolph? I mean, that was exactly the same as Huddersfield. Exactly the same cross. Exactly the same step over from Kadeem Harris. Superb. And there was Fletch almost at the far post. Throwing to be taken here by uh, Dyke Steele. He puts it short. Borough well, trying to find a way to get a crossover there with McNerd. McNerd, I should say, who gets it again. McNerd does really well. He's in the box. There's a sliding tackle put oh! on him by Bannon. How oh, amazing that is. I mean, that's a bucket, isn't it? Well, uh, Bannon was sliding in and he tried to, uh, I suppose, con the referee there, didn't he, as he went down to the ground. 
Johnson puts the cross in. That's a really good delivery. Comes back out and it's slammed in. And Middlesbrough have got a goal back. Absolutely thumped into the goal there. A quality cross, it must be said. And Middlesbrough thrown a lifeline there. And it's Paddy McNair. Well, what a superb strike that was. They've looked dangerous the last couple of minutes. Middlesbrough look as though they were fighting their way back into the game. That is an absolute quality strike. There was no chance for anybody to save that. The game is back on. Wednesday tearing it up down the right-hand side with Odebadjo carrying it a long way. And then he plays it short and inside for Rich. Gets it back, does the fullback. Odebadjo just needing to be careful and he's passed it back for Rich. Gone out. Just allowed that one to run and he couldn't keep it in play. I'm not sure it was the greatest pass to him there from Moses Odebadjo, but uh, Reach has won it back from the throw, and now here's New You just outside the box. Reach now looks to take it on! Oh! Oh! Reach! Puts that ball out of Reach! What a and goal! Randolph! And Wednesday have a two-goal cushion once again, and Adam Reach for the second game running here at the Riverside Stadium is on the score sheet. He was the match winner last time. He could well be again for Sheffield Wednesday. A fantastic game this is already. Well, that was quality from Adam Reach. Absolutely superb. He's, his back lift is hardly anything. He's hardly. He's just pumped that ball right into the corner. He's picked it out. It's a superb finish. Brilliant, Adam Reach. Just plays it inside there towards uh, Bannon. Bannon Great really ball. is on top form today, switching it away towards the right-hand side. It goes down the line now. Reach with a chance to cross over. Can he oh. stick it in towards somebody? It's gone too long. And uh, well well, all done. Middlesbrough do is panic a little bit. They've headed it behind. And uh, Johnson decided to take no chances and concedes a corner. Jim Wilshire says, give us a shout-out, John. Me, Leon and Luke watching from Menorca. Great start. Will Pickles. Big shout-out to Wednesday fans around the globe. Half-time suggestion, John, from Wilf Pickles in Portugal. So it is uh, Barry Bannon to take this. And in it goes, Wednesday with uh, Hutchinson attacking the ball. It's towards oh! the centre, this one goes over the top. Was that Was that Atty? I'm not 100% sure because Julian Berner was also there. It goes over the top from Wednesday. Let's have a look, let's have a look. We've got a replay it's on coming. it. Let's have a look, see what it was. It's well worked, Sam heads it back. Still can't see. <laughs> the sunlight was a little bit in the way. But uh, another really good chance for Sheffield Wednesday. We're seeing it again. Marvin Johnson just trying to get away there from Liam Palmer. And he's, he's quick and tricky, is this fullback. Is this winger, I should say, against the fullback. Comes backwards. McNair puts it into the middle, headed away by Burner. Goes back for Clayton. Clayton puts a sort of cross. Come, well, I don't think it's a shot. It's just a sort of general punt towards the box that Kieran Westwood has reached up and taken hold. And Atenuiu put him under pressure. That's a good kick. It is a good kick. He's trying to find He's got a, it. He's got a runner it. on the right hand side. And now uh, Wednesday have Onabajo just uh, playing it back in towards uh, Reach. Reach puts it into the centre. Can Fletcher get there? Oh! Oh! have had any right to win that but he has and he's managed to head home past Randolph beating him at his post and Wednesday are now 4-1 up this is well exactly what the game plan must have been from Gary Monk I talked about having the land of giants up front with Atty Nuiu and Stephen Fletcher and Fletcher now registers and Wednesday lead by four goals to one well what a terrific ball from Adam Reach. he's picked him out and, he's, and Fletcher's done what he's been doing all season. He nods it down. The keeper's got no chance. And the keeper will be disappointed, I think, getting beat at the near post. In the interception, but uh, just took him out of play. Middlesbrough seeing a little bit of the ball at the moment. Coming forward, it goes in towards Shotton. And it's worked on towards Fletcher. Fletcher tried to turn, but again, I all for strong and... Gets it away, only as far as uh, McNair. Lays it off. Ayala pushes nice it ball. through. Good ball for Johnson. Johnson 
onto his left foot. He stands it up. That's a great ball punched away there by Westwood. Really good cross, but only as far as Shotton. Will he fancy the shot? He tries to bend it back in. It's headed down now. Asamba Longa slices it wide. Well, maybe it's because I wrote him off. I don't know, but he nearly came back to haunt me for that comment. But uh, he did get that all wrong, didn't he, really? He's got to stick that away. That is a massive, massive let off for us. It's a great cross to the far post, headed back down. It's a Samba Longa against Westwood. Yeah, it's he Fletcher just that. cushioned it down, and he sliced it wide. He's totally, totally scuffed that one. Woods now for Ayala. Ayala returns it back for Fletcher, and Fletcher drops his shoulder, and he's uh, kept his balance. There was a little push there from Luongo. It's crossed over. It's a low ball that's turned away by Iorfa. Great back heel from Shotton, and now it's worked through. This could be a chance for uh, Britta Samba Longa. He's off balance again, and he's put it into the side netting. Again, he should put that away. I'm glad he hasn't. Well, that's another. That's two. That's two misses from a player who links them up for breakfast. That was so simple. You've got an open goal. There's a chance it could have been 4-3. Thompson still, plays it through, and it somehow comes one. through to him. Westwood comes, doesn't get there, and he ends up hitting the side netting. It wasn't hard. It wasn't a hard chance to miss. Just opportunities that. Any, any, anybody would have been disappointed that they've not uh, scored those, but... Here's Adam Reach. Let's see whether we can craft something here. Reach puts it ball. into the middle. The goalkeeper misses it, and Fletcher was coming in there, trying to head home. But it will be a goal kick. Well, I think that cross has hit Fletcher rather than uh, he's headed it. He's just got there. It's a superb cross. The keeper's not got to it. He's come out. What a big, big mistake. He's desperately trying to fling himself at it. It was uh, quite powerful. He struck that cross. Yeah, I don't think he could do anything about that. He didn't expect that to, uh, to come to him. Wednesday with Liam Palmer trying to stay tight there to uh, Johnson. And Johnson takes a tumble. Again, he's, he's always looking for the free kick. He doesn't get one. He looks it's across the referee. Header. It doesn't happen. And Wednesday break the other way. Here's Fletcher. Stephen well Fletcher. Take. In a bit of space, he plays it inside now for Reach, who dabs it back now for Luongo, tries to fire it through. It's a chance for Iorfa! In fact, it wasn't. It was Onobadjo who was uh, playing full back there, wasn't it? And uh, you have to say, Randolph does really well making himself big, but you'd expect him to tuck that away, perhaps, from that position. Well, I don't think he realised how much time he got. He was through. He was one-on-one. -on -one. He was clean through. I think he could have had another touch. So two great opportunities for them, one for us. Brave, and he might get it for the second time of asking. Now Reach, can he spread the play towards the left? That's what he's done, looking for Harris's legs to get after it, but uh, well read by Dyke Steele. It's been a good battle on that side between those two, both very quick. The fullback just there ahead of Harris, who would have been away. It's come back now towards wing as Burrow looked to put more pressure on. They go from distance, and was there a touch there from Westwood? No. It goes wide. I think he's just covered his post. He knows it's going wide. And Jonathan Woodgate continues to patrol his technical area as the ball goes long up towards Winnell from the goalkeeper. Hands back on the halfway line with Odebajo trying to lift it up over the top of uh, Shotton's head was Adam Reach. He's headed out of play though for a throw in for Wednesday. There's two more minutes remain. What a bad show towards Reach comes inwards and passes it away Great now for pass. Liam Palmer. Go on, Liam, have Palmer. a goal. Go on, have a Can goal. Can he cap it off with a goal in this second half? Tries to thread it through. Winnell has a chance. Saved. Comes back out Wednesday. Good Can't shot. get there. Good Randolph play. makes a stop, though. Yeah, it was a good stop. It's good play, Liam Palmer. It away. Again. Palmer again. Oh, oh that was short. short. Looking for Bannon. So the good shot from Sam Winnell. He there kicks we go. it in towards the Middlesbrough half, and there is the full-time whistle. And Wednesday did all of their work in the main in the first half. We had a goal feast, didn't we, for 45 minutes. A great start, an own goal from Clayton, lofting the header over the top of his own goalkeeper from a corner from Bannon. Then a minute later, Dominic Iorfa with a bullet header of his own, doubling Wednesday's advantage. Paddy McNair made it interesting when he slotted in with a rifled effort. And then uh, two further goals from Adam Reach and uh, Stephen Fletcher. Describe that uh, contest, really. Not quite as lively second half, was it? 
Like we said, you know, uh, when a team's so far in front, it never usually is.